Think Like an Artist is a special project that I produced for Knit Stars Season 6, Live Colourfully. Knit Stars produce high quality, really beautiful, amazingly well-filmed knitting masterclasses with different designers and artists. Robin Fox, who filmed my class, also films Nigella, so the videos are amazing. We don't live in the art gallery, we live in the everyday, um, in, in the everyday, in daily life, and I love the abundance of contemplating that space as a totally rich and ongoing resource of inspiration. In my masterclass, I wanted to show people how to translate inspirations into stranded colour work, but I wanted to do it in a way that's more structured than just take anything, be inspired by anything, turn it into stranded colour work. I wanted to make a project that would also dig into the creative underpinnings of my own practice, a project that meets you wherever you are. So when I was thinking about this class and thinking about how I could pack all of these different ideas into one achievable knitting project, I, I thought we need a container for all these different ideas. So that's what this cowl is. Um, it's kind of a vessel that gives you 12 different sections, each of which you can either knit exactly as it is in the pattern or you can do your own thing with it. At every point in the masterclass, I give you options. So you can just do what I did, or you can use the tips and tricks and resources I share to learn from what I did and do your own thing with it. For example, I talk about the yarn palettes I produce for the project, and I also provide loads of resources to help you with putting together your own palette if you prefer. So I hope that in talking through putting together the Alma palette which celebrates Alma Thomas, the Georgia O'Keeffe palette which celebrates Georgia O'Keeffe and the Bobby Baker palette which celebrates Bobby Baker. I hope that's given you a kind of framework so that if you want to put your own palette together for this Knit Stars class you've got a kind of framework within which to work. Think like an artist. This cowl that I've designed speaks to the work of women artists. It's in 12 sections and each section of colour work is inspired by a different artist in a different way. In the masterclass, I talk about the sections, how they were each inspired by an artist, how I've taken that artist's practice into the knitting. And there's a really detailed handout that explains all of that. It's really an ebook. It gives you a window into all of these different artists represented in the cow. Felix, I just have to tell you how much I am loving doing your cowl. I have been a big fan of yours since I re-entered the knitting foray a few years ago, but in this workshop, you have just excelled. It is amazing. What work you put into this design and the charts, unbelievable effort. I have all six knit stars and your workshop is definitely number one for me. I chose to use Marie Wallen's British Breeds. After two days of faffing around getting the 20 colors down to 12, I just had to pick them and start as you recommended. Nearly finished section two. The background information is so useful and by working with the color and the artists, one can really understand it and how certain combinations work or don't work. It is sparking such joy in this long January. In Canada, much snow. Leslie. One way you can do this project is just to do it exactly as described, use the pattern, and you can just learn about the artists as you knit each section. Another way you can do the cow, pick your own palette, knit the pattern as I have, but just change the colors. And another option, take the pointers and the ideas and the blank chart templates and all the resources I've provided and be inspired by these artists to create your own charts and your own shading sequences. If you want to change the shading sequence in any one of these sections, I'm going to talk you through how I think about those things. I've really designed the class to meet you on all of those different levels, wherever you are as a knitter. Make it exactly as I have or change a little bit or everything about the cowl. And there really is support all the way through to do that. I just watched Felix. I absolutely love it. It just really made me look at things differently. I have always wanted to knit the colors I saw one year on a fall hike we took into the Olympic Peninsula. She just showed me how. Mary Topfa. 
The easiest way for you to do this project is to join me in the Yarniverse. The classes are streamed and as long as you're a subscriber, you have access to them. Subscribing gives you instant access to Think Like an Artist, but you also gain access to tons of other amazing masterclasses with fantastic designers and makers and to weekly live online events. Everything in the Yarniverse is well signposted and if you want to make Think Like an Artist, there's a special learning track which includes that class and many others about colour called Seeker Track Colour Work. Here's a glimpse inside the Yarniverse and what you'll see in there if you're heading over to do Think Like an Artist. Look how much other amazing stuff is in here. You'll find my whole class, that's all in there, all the beautiful videos that Robin Fox and his team filmed. They're all in there and you'll find my massive handout broken up into sections. You can see where they all are here. I've had really positive feedback on this class and if you sign up to the Yarniverse through my affiliate link, which is the QR code on the screen right now, I will get paid a commission. Thank you so much. This is part of how Knit Stars continue to support and reinvest in makers like me. See you in the Yarniverse.